Hey there Titan, so in this video I'll show you how to get your Word document digitally signed with the form Titan add-in for Word. So let's start, let's bring in a, a field. Let's say we want to uh, grab the account object and we'll give it a comment and let's bring in the account name and we'll insert this guy and let's bring in the uh, account type. And now let's add in our signature. So in the signature option, we will show the di digital invisible. That means we, you will not be required to uh, actually sign the document. Just whenever you render this, it will be uh, digitally signed automatically. So we're going to select our object and you can do comments, role, CD, country name, postal code, state or province directly from Salesforce or you can do it statically. Um, for example, if I'll choose dynamic, so in the comments I'll add the account name and then for the rest of them I'm just gonna do static. Um, so let's do static row and we'll do static city and static country name. And same for the postal code. And same for the state of province. And we'll hit insert. And that's the only thing we need to do. We'll, now we'll head over to publish and publish this into the form Titan. So I'm going to just make sure my filter is good. So account ID equals record ID. And nothing else needed. And I'm going to publish it to a form that I pre-prepared, digital signature work. I'm going to do publish template and hit override since I already have a template there. Now we're going to head over to our form Titan and we're going to go to our form digital signature work. And the only thing we need to set up here is head over to our document generation, word mapping, configure and head over to our signature and check this guy, enable signature. We'll hit apply. Um, now we will publish our form. And I'm gonna pass in an account ID as a parameter. So let's grab the account ID. Uh, this F field ID is FLD2. So let's add this guy over here and we'll grab an account from Salesforce, little donkey, and I will reload this guy and hit submit. And we'll do continue. I've set up automatic download on the settings. So once that's done, it will download it directly into my computer. So I have my uh, Word document downloaded to my computer. Now we're gonna open it and preview it. And here is our document. We can see that as soon as we open it up, it gives me the protected view. Be careful um, since uh, um, this is uh, protected. And we'll click the enable editing. And now take a look. It shows me that we have a signature here. So I can click on the view signatures. And then on the panel on the right side, I have the signature information. So let's click on the signature details. And we can see that the uh, here is my comment, little donkey, which I mapped to the account name. And let's take a look at the full information. So I'm gonna click on the C information about the signer. We can see that it was signed by Form Titan, and we got all the static information. Here is our role, static role, static city, state, zip, and country. And again, you can set this to be completely dynamic from Salesforce, just like we did with the comment. Let's take a look at this guy. And we have all the signature information. If you do like to edit it, then you could just do edit anyway, and then the signature will be gone. And now it's an unsigned document. And this is how it's done.